They almost set star as orders and off they go for the running of the five star shipping juvenile sprinters million. Grade three missing the kick was uh, born to be spoiled almost about four lengths at the start. And on settling down to race, Kenef gets straight down to business, hitting the front by about the length and a quarter in front. Dedicate on the outside, two and a half lengths behind his leather back. Long lease is next, and uh, then comes another two and a half lengths behind his call me. And for the five lengths behind is born to be spoiled as he travels towards the 700 meter marker. Kenaf it is, by about three lengths in front of Dedicators, nicely settled in second, leather back in third. Long lease comes to next, they have been followed by Call Me and Want to Be Spoilt is uh, almost about eight to ten lengths behind as they begin to approach the final turn and straighten up for the uh, final run-in. They got out a little over 400 to run the running of this five-star shipping juvenile sprinters, million grade three. Kenaf is the leader, Dedicated is the one which is inching his way on the outside. Leatherback is the one which is looking good on the outside. And behind them is Longlease, but inside the final 200 meters, Leatherback from Longlease now putting in a spirited gallop on the outside. It's going to be Longlease on the outside from Leatherback. Longlease from Leatherback, Longlease, Leatherback. They're going strike for strike, head for head. But Longlease now travels the better to win the five-star shipping juvenile sprinters, million from Leatherback. Then comes uh, Dedicate followed by uh, Call Me, then comes Kenaf and ending up last was born to be spoiled. It was an impressive win. It's a double for her. Even though she's had a delayed start, she's shown a great outburst of speed both the both the roundings. Tell us about this Philly for us and also your plans for the in future. Uh, well she's uh, very well bred and she's actually bred to stay, but she's showing us a lot of speed and we want to capitalize on it and uh, this was one race which uh, came in our way and we thought that it's uh, it'll be a good step up to put her in the deep end and hopefully we'll try and take her longer from here that's really great coming to today's race were you expecting her to take over the running from leather black in the last full long well yeah of course i was expecting her to take it over you know that was uh, mm -hmm. the intention of putting the final entry we thought we had a real life chance uh, Leatherback has run a hell of a race and uh, I hope I improve from there and we hope for better things. All the best for that. Congratulations again. Thank you so much for talking to us. What was the plan today? What was the strategy and did it pan out the same, same way? Uh, it didn't pan out the way we wanted it to actually. She likes to run from the front mm -hmm. but she stumbled in the start and she's a very big hearted filly to come back from there. Mm -hmm. She put her head straight back into the race and she was very professional. That's really great. Thank you so much for talking to us. Congratulations again.